Like, no, come back. No problem. Yeah, that one day you have to question. Okay. So, what Sorry, you not what? Can I, can I? You guys just, you guys like evangelize it. Yeah, yeah, just. Or, like, what do you do? Are you here to argue? Yeah, no, 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 no. I mean, arguing, <laughs> arguing does happen, obviously, but we no, don't. But is that your point? Like, is that why you guys stand here? No, no, no. Okay, this is this is the book of Matthew, 10, 34, 36. I've read the whole chapter. I've read the whole chapter. But read the whole chapter. Okay. Read the Matthew 10, what? Do not think I have come to bring peace to the earth. I have not to bring. Do not think I have come to bring peace to the earth. I have not to. I have not come to bring peace, but a sword. For I have come to set a man against his father. <laughs> Sorry, sorry. Okay. So Jesus, the, the author, the unknown, anonymous author, Matthew, he said that Jesus said, do not think that I have come to bring peace to the earth. I have not come to bring peace, but a sword. For I have come to set a man against his father and a daughter against her mother, a daughter-in-law against her mother-in-law, and a person's enemies will be those of his own household. So I, I was mistaken. He didn't say I've come, but he said I haven't come for peace. I've come with a sword. And Jesus says in Luke that none of you can be my disciple until you hate your mother and your father. Oh, okay. Is that what you really think? Shall I show, shall I show you? Okay. Let me show you. Yeah. Pick out, pick out one. You pick out. Okay. Because we haven't done that. But oh, no problem, no problem. But, but did, did, did Jesus, did Jesus say I haven't come with peace? I've come with the sword. See, no, but yeah, but do you know what the sword is? is? No, let me find out the definition. Do you know what the sword is? 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 Okay. So you see the sword in the Holy Spirit. The sword is the sword of the Holy Spirit, which is the word. The word. The word is our spirit sword. Yeah. You know what you're finding? We find the spiritual realm, right? So when you're finding the spiritual realm, for your spirit to be able to battle, you use the word. And you know, we call, literally, I read it today, there was a verse today, it says, the sword is our word. Yeah? Okay. So we refer a lot to in the Bible that the sword is our word. Look, here we go. Hebrews 4.12, Hebrews 4.12, for the word of God is a lamb powerful. It is sharper than the sharpest two-edged sword. So a lot of the time in the Bible, you see now you're taking the word of God, 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 the word of but he still has, he still hasn't he come with peace. Come with peace. Let the girl come with peace. Let the girl come with In chapter 4, Matthew chapter 4, Jesus fought the yeah. temptation, fought the devil with uh -huh. the sword, which was the word. He quoted scriptures in the, um, to fight the devil. Yeah. So uh -huh. Jesus, God tells us, your sword to fight off principality, to fight off evil spirit, is the Bible. Is word. And that's the Matthew God. The word. Is the so the sword yeah. is not a physical Read sword, Matthew. it is your word. It is uh -huh. the but he still hasn't come with peace though, has he? He has. Oh, he has. No problem, no problem. <laughs> can I just can I give you one last verse? Go on. I'm just waiting for reception. So. Okay. Yeah, I need to talk to you. I have a lot of sorrow. You have a lot of sorrow. You know, you were supposed to bring up your sorrow. Yeah, okay. Bring it up. No problem, no problem. So okay. You guys said Jesus was pure, right? Okay. If you, if you want to find it quicker than me, Luke chapter 19, verse 27. Yeah, he can use it. Chapter 19. This is, a, this is a parable. This is what Jesus said. You said after yours, we're going to bring up ours. So let us bring ours first. Okay, okay. So, 1927? Okay, yes, yeah, 19. let me bring up mine. But they're trying to explain. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. They were trying to. They say, no, no, that's not. Okay, so you said in the beginning that Jesus is pure, right? Ah. Okay, so you're sure? No, not, there's pure and there's sinless. So Jesus was sinless. Jesus was pure, let's say that you're sure. But then Prophet Muhammad was not sinless. Prophet Muhammad slept with his, um, slept with his son's wife, right? No. He was adopted. So what did he do? No, no, no. Yes, he did. He said that you're sure. Okay. Wait, who did he speak with? He married his adopted son's ex-wife. Still sinless. That's right. 
that's even. Is he in a safe? So, so, so he, he married. He married her. Is, is that is that wrong? Wait, is, is it wrong? No, no, no. I don't know. No, in the Bible, you're not allowed to divorce. And whoever is, if a woman is divorced, and then she marries again, she's an adulterous woman in the Bible, in Christianity. But in, in Islam, if a woman is divorced. She's free to be married again. Okay, that's not okay, so why did Prince right Muhammad be yeah, like his mission on earth to marry women? No, of course not. His mission okay. was to call people to worship okay, one so God. Okay, cool. yeah. so you, got, you said Surah 19 verse 19. Jesus was pure no, and no. without sin. Where did it say Surah that? 19 verse 19. Let me get the verse. God. What did it, it say? Jesus was pure and without sin. But Prophet Muhammad... It, say, it says pure without sin. And Prophet Muhammad had to pray to, forgive, to Allah to forgive his sins okay. in Surah 40 verse 25. Let me see. So, your Muhammad was full of sin, but Jesus was not. Wasn't. Where does it say that he was without sin? Um, 19 verse 19. Is there an English version of the Quran? Uh, yes. Is there an English version of the Quran? Yeah, you can take one with you. Uh, to give you a pure child, a, a pure child. But that doesn't mean without sin. Are all children born pure or are they born sinful? What's that? No, I don't know. What are you trying to Okay, this is when Mary, when Mary, when the angel Gabriel comes to her and gives her glad tidings she's going to have a son. Okay, and she's going to have a pure child. Does a, does a child being pure, does it mean without sin? I mean, as in, it's never going to commit sin in its whole life. Are all, are all children, are all children, are all children uh, born pure? No one's born pure. Everyone's born to sin. So if so if so if a baby dies, paradise or hellfire? No, that's different. She's a baby. Jesus won't judge you unless you know right from wrong. Yes, when you know right from wrong. When you know a baby, a baby, a baby doesn't know right from wrong. So a baby's pure. Basically, yeah. Unless in the Bible it told us to be like a child. Be like so many times because that is when you're that is when you guys believe anyone who's below when you have hit people you're going to heaven. Yes. Uh, but how? Yeah. Because you can still be young. You can still be like before puberty and have sin. No, no. You have to. You have to intend to commit a sin. As a child, then the pen is lifted. The pen is. You're not responsible for your actions as a child. But let's stick to this. So, someone yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. You're right. Wait. Okay. So let's say you're 15. You haven't commit. You haven't. Um, you haven't hit puberty, but like you're having sex. You're killing people. So what, no, still, no, 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 no. A person has to understand what they're doing is wrong before they so they're considered right? sinful. Yeah. yeah. But you said yeah. if you have hit people, you're gonna. The, the scholars they mentioned tamiz. Tamiz is distinction. You can distinguish between right and wrong. But the thing is, the point is here. Where does it say that Jesus is pure? Yeah, I didn't not pure. No. Where does it say that he's sinless? Because all children are born pure. Yeah. All children are sinless. You're born sinless. Wait, no, what did you say about the whole Jesus and Muhammad thing? How Muhammad is full of sin. Yeah. But no, but I'm, ask, I'm asking Muhammad you what sin did he commit? Muhammad? Oh, yeah. that's <laughs> fuck. You tell us. Yeah, you, you, know, you, you tell us. us. I'm asking you. Don't you. Think no, no, but you tell us. You tell us. Tell us what sin did he commit. No, no, but you know you're Muhammad. No, no, you want to teach us. You want to teach us. Okay. What did he... No, okay, I'll look it up his head. We gave I'll look it up. Because no, the no, rules, no. we're we'll looking at interactive. No, no, no. We gave it up. Are you going to tell us out? Should I look it up? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No problem. But the, the, the thing is just the last point. If you say he is sinful or he committed sins, then obviously the next thing is for me to say, what no, sin did he commit? The Quran, okay, is it Surah 40, 50, verse 55? Yeah. He had to pray for forgiveness of his sins to Muhammad. Yes. yes. And it's her Anna. No. A man that uh -huh. committed sin. But if he didn't have yeah. to, well, he repent. Okay, the thing is... The one that... Uh, what, what, what? The one okay. that committed sin is the one that you're trusting for your... For your... No, literally, your, your, your Quran, To deliver your... The, the true, word. true word. But Jesus, the, word the one that's sinless, the one that you guys... I saw that he's coming back. Uh, he's not... <laughs> Anyway, I really want to understand. Okay, look, the thing is, the thing is, the thing is, look. Firstly, you haven't brought a sin of the Prophet Muhammad You haven't what? You haven't brought a okay, sin. Okay, I'll bring it up then. If okay. you, do you want me to bring it? I'll bring it. I'll bring it. Is that a sin? What? He just told me to. Is it a sin? So let me bring it. Okay, was he married when he slept with her? Yes. 
I mean, so like, what, what, what is it? Okay, okay, the Bible, the Bible. Simple. Like Jesus prayed, you know? uh, a simple you pray, question. Pray Jesus in the Bible, prayed. in the Bible. Okay, you know Jesus prayed standing up. Jesus prayed Jesus. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It means he's Okay, listen, listen. What's the age? What's the age of marriage in the Bible? Can we stop stop deflecting? Can you answer our question first? No, no, no. Yeah, the the young lady. He said he's sinful because he, he married a nine year old. Okay, so do, yeah. you, do you morally think it's right for an, an elderly man to marry, to marry a, a child? Let's actually be married. Would you do that? Yes. But I'm, I'm, ask, but I'm asking you, where in, but where, where in the Bible, look, look, think, where in the Bible, where in the Bible, where in the Bible, where in the Bible does it tell you the age of marriage? No, but it's not about that, a nine-year-old and you think, okay, No, 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 what is the meaning of answering this question? What is the meaning of No, but you know what? So, Muhammad admitted he was a sinner. Let me find it up now. I want to know. And I'm on your, your Islam website. No, 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 no. Let me find it. Let me find it. I don't think I'm going to say that. Is it morally, morally okay, okay to worship something created by God? Is it morally <laughs> correct to worship something which God has created? God created something. You you say that the marriage of the Prophet Muhammad is something no good, yeah? Yeah? I will ask you this question and compare it to the Prophet Muhammad. Jesus, you believe that he's God, and you believe that he can come from the sky, from the ground, from the tree. He can come from anywhere. Why, why he chose to come from a little girl private part? He became what? What? Sorry, Where he come from? He come from a little girl private part. Not private part. He was born. Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait. Where he come from? He, he came, he came from, from a little girl. girl. Huh? How else can a human be born? I don't understand the question. Then he come, he come, he come from a little girl private part. I want to see. Is that Mary was a little girl? Okay, but to be, to be, to be, to be, um, to be, um, to be born, you have to come out from a little girl private part. But he's God. He can come from the tree. Listen, 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 listen. He can come from the tree. He's God. He can come from. Can a human ascend from the tree? Then, then Jesus. What is the age of marriage in the Bible? What's the age of marriage in the Bible? He was Jesus is human. What is the age of marriage in the Bible? What's the age of marriage in the Bible? He's God. Yeah, in charge. No. He can come from the sky, from the ground. Okay. If, if he wanted to, he could. If he wanted to, he could, because he's God. If, if he wants to come from the sky, he can come from the sky. If he can, if he wants to come from the ground, he can come from yeah. the ground. Then why he choose? Why he choose to come from a little girl private park? That is immoral. That's that's is immoral. No, but that's that's his worst. Okay, but that's worst. That's worst. That's worst. That's worst. That's worst. Be, before. Your before, yes, 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 <laughs> anyway, anyway, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. No problem. Teach me, teach me, teach me. Best still. Yes. No, we have to. When you're a humble servant, whatever the Lord, whatever the Lord decides you to do. Before talking about how, how can God be a humble servant? It was a conversation. Excuse me. How can God be a humble servant? How can how can God? How can God? No, no. How can? Listen to the question. How can God be a humble servant? No, I want to know. You need to tell me the sins that were made. Yeah, I'm bringing okay. it up. Okay, one at a time. What is the age of consent in the Bible? I mean, the, you, you, be, you, be, you, you believe the Bible is a complete book of guidance for all mankind. So if you're going to say that someone marrying a nine-year-old is sinful, you have to show me from the Bible it's sinful. But no, but that is sinful. No, it's just wrong. You said it's morally Maybe you didn't, but... What, is morally wrong sinful? Has she touched Those Google it? Yes. Yes. So if you were to if you were to go marry a man, how much would you do? Do you think that's exactly? No, I wouldn't. Exactly. No. But the question is, is it because we're living in a different time, a different place? But look, let me let me just say something. You know, if you if you look, 
you don't have to accept it from me. Look at English law, look at American law. The age of marriage before 100 years, before 200 years. You're, you're, you know in English law, 200 years ago, you can marry at seven. Okay, okay. You know, you know that. What about Tobo? You know when you said. <laughs> yes. No, no, just, oh, yes. You know when you said yes. about you want me to bring up the evidence. Yes. Can I bring up that two scriptures where he confessed yes. his sin? Right? Yes. Does that just happen? You even you even brought yeah, up one. Uh, uh, I didn't even want to open it. What, what's the right there? Because I want to read it in English. You guys are doing the machine gun. That's English. Yeah, but I don't know where to read it. You know you guys oh. are doing the machine gun. Yeah, I don't know how to read it. You're doing machine gun. No, he was doing the machine gun. No, he, he, he was doing the machine gun. No, it's fine, it's fine. I, 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 I spoke, I spoke yeah, a lot. I spoke a lot, I spoke a lot. <laughs> don't make it conflict. Yeah, but it's a bit Here. Oh, I'm sorry. Surah what? This one here. Surah what? I think it's 48. Is it 48? Yeah, yeah. Kind of no, but you know, yeah. but you know already right. that he confessed that he sinned, right? Show me where he could confess his sins. If we, yeah. if we show I don't him, know how to use what's the best way? But we show, can I, can no, I? No, no, that was the page. You read it if you like. 48 verse 1, no, 1 and 2. 40. Yeah, that's where we were. No, 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 let me show you again. Yeah, I don't know how to pull up this. Okay. Oh, is that what you, okay. Thank you so much for the rest of No, 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 no. Listen, 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 listen. No, listen, no, listen, no. Listen, no. Listen, listen. When you can explain that part to me, then I'll leave it. Okay. Cool. So you okay. sinned. So what does okay. that mean? So what does that mean? Be patient, O Muhammad. Indeed, the promise of Allah is truth. And yeah. ask forgiveness for your sin. And exalt with praise of your Lord in the evening and the morning. Okay. Hold this, yeah. if you don't mind. I'm going to see He's what the, bring out the, the explanation. The, 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 the scholars, okay, the scholars yeah. are. No problem. What's the other the hadith. one? The hadith. No, 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 no. Did you say an explanation? Why yes. can't you just explain yourself? Yeah. Because I have to give a correct answer, isn't it? Is that okay? No, that's fine. That's okay. fine. But can you turn that camera? I know it's yeah, sweet. Yeah, that's because I'm Yeah, bro, oh my God. That camera okay. is doing right in our faces. Well, I'm not turning up. I can actually just do it on purpose. Let me see. <laughs> Wait, can I ask you this? Do you see how you guys believe in Allah? No, I just want to ask, no, just a simple question. What makes you, just yeah, what like, what is like, wow, what, what has he done? That Allah what has he done? No, 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 no. What makes you know that Allah loves you? Allah loves you. Allah loves you. Allah loves you. No, 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 they even tell you. What makes you say yeah. that? Is it a question though? No, but look, what makes you think Allah loves you? What makes you think Allah loves you? We'll get the same answer for all of you guys, individually. Just what? What is like? He gave me, he showed me himself, how, how did he show through scripture, plus he proved, he gave me evidence. No, no, don't do that. No. Don't do that. Plus he gave me evidences. Yeah? Who is give evidences? I have no doubt that they believe that he's the creator. No, I mean, okay. I can't. Can we, can we get back to the conversation? No, 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 I want to. He's finding his thing. Are you done? Oh, it's here, it's here, it's here. Are you done? Yes, it's here. You done? I'm done. Oh, okay, sorry. I thought you were here. I was just trying no to... No problem. So, whether you accept it or not, Ibn Kathir... Yeah. Please don't ask... Don't even try to ask another question. Answer the question. Because yeah. you like to qu question no. without the answer. <laughs> did I do that? Yeah, yeah you did that. <laughs> I will check. Okay. So, Ibn Kathir... He's one of the early Muslim scholars. He mentioned here... Wait, this is from a scholar, not from the... The actual one. Yeah. Just to yes, 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 yes. Okay. Yeah. So, wait, so, so it's an opinion. This is an opinion. Yes. Okay. Okay. No, let him read it. 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 It's someone that has an opinion, that has studied the Quran, or studied oh, that the book, that has a, a degree in it or whatever. Okay. So then you have... No, we don't have an opinion on the Quran. Okay, okay. carry on, carry on. Answer the question. This is questions even for me. These are the questions. Thank you. Okay. So was thankfully done So seek forgiveness for your sin. Yeah. This Ibn Kathir said, "Hada tahyij al ummah al istighfar." This is to encourage the ummah, the followers of the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, to seek forgiveness. It's to uncover. Yeah. Yes. No, no, so, but, yes. but, that, but, but does it mean that he sinned or he? So did he lie? Yeah, uh, uh, is there a lie? Is there a lie or? No. So he did sin. No. Let me explain to you. Okay, explain. In the Quran, I'll give you many ex examples where the Prophet Muhammad وسلم, has been commanded with something, but the intent is his followers. Okay? So here, Ibn Kathir, whether you accept or not, Ibn Kathir is saying that when the when Allah said to the, the Prophet, Allah? Ibn Kathir, that's the person's name. Oh, the person. Yeah. Yeah. He said in this verse, 
When Allah told the Prophet ﷺ to seek forgiveness for your sins, it is a, it's encouragement for the followers of the Prophet Muhammad to seek forgiveness no, but for then their wouldn't sins. He have, wouldn't uh -huh. he have just directly said, guys, make sure you ask for forgiveness, not say for himself, Lord, I mean, this, forgive me this, for my this, sins. He okay. said, my, no problem. my yeah. sins. But I am what I'm you a are, you are no, not no, the one who decides. No, no problem, no problem. No, no, I'm just asking. No problem, please. no problem. This is the style of Quran. I can give you many verses where the Prophet is commanded with something, but the intent is the followers. So still, whether you accept it or not, still the question comes back to you because his whole life is documented. Where he was born, Wait, who his parents were. Let, let me finish, let me, let me finish. Because okay. you're asking another question. No, no I'm, I'm trying to explain. His whole life is documented. Yeah. So if you say he's a sinner, I would expect you to bring a sin that he committed, meaning he disobeyed God. So what? So from your knowledge, he yeah. doesn't say what sin he committed in the Quran. Now I'm asking you as a, are you no. a mom? No, 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 I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm an everyday person. Yeah, okay. yes. well, now I'm just asking you, yes. in, in the Quran yes. that you've read, does it say, be okay. honest, don't lie, because you can go to half a lie, no? Yeah. No problem. Be honest, yes. does it say in the Quran what sin he committed, or are you just trying to... No. Does it say, it doesn't say? No. So wouldn't you wouldn't you classify that as a confusion then? Because so what that guy has done is just an, imp, an inter okay. interpretation, right? It's yeah. not what. Let me explain to you. Let me explain to you. But what do you know? You could be just when it comes to the right? when it comes to the messengers, those who are chosen by God to deliver a message, we say they are free from committing major sins. Major? Oh, you guys measure sins. Yes, oh, they can they can commit That's errors, but for, for, for example. We don't believe that Suleiman worshipped idols. We don't believe that David committed adultery. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. We don't believe that Lot committed incest with his two daughters. Yeah. Okay. The problem is, even in the Bible, the Bible is showing you that Jesus did commit sins, which we don't attribute to him. Okay, in the Bible, what, what is the sin of cursing your parents? Pardon? What is the sin of disrespecting your parents in the oh, Bible? I know what you're trying to do. You, yeah. know, you know that, you know that, have you guys read the part in the Bible where um, Jesus went to the temple to preach uh, the gospel, but his mum was waiting for him at home? He didn't tell his mum where he was going. He didn't tell his no, mom no, mom. I, I'm worse than that. Are you talking about that? Madam, I, about that? I, I spoke a lot, but I need to go and pray. Can oh, I be, yeah, can I be fine, excused? This conversation right. was good. No problem. We're here every Saturday. You hey, can bring you. more of your arguments. Did you want to take it? Thank, Thank you very you. much for your time.